Today we're going to discuss how to build a login within iRISE. What I want you to do first is within your materials attached to this tutorial, go to File, Import iDoc as a new project, and select the 2009 July 6 Login iDoc Start iDoc. And when you click Open, that will allow you to create a new project with that iDoc as a starting point. And why don't we call this uh, login tutorial and click create. Now as you can see here I've already created a page that has an area for a login which we'll be creating here momentarily. And what we want to do for this page is we want to create a master. And what a master is is a piece of functionality that can be used over and over in a page without being recreated. If you're familiar with the programming world, it's kind of like a control in the uh, .NET world. So I'm going to click this button that creates a new master, and we're going to call this Login Widget. Now, within my home page, I know that this area that I want my login to be is 200 by 200. So for my Login Widget, I'm going to size this at about 175 to 175 and as you can see it changes size. Now I want to add two labels in, one for username and I'm just going to copy and paste that and have one called password. Now I'm going to do a little formatting here. Now I want to add in two text boxes, one for username and one for password copy and paste. Next thing I want to do is I want to name those text boxes. So this is going to be a username text and this is going to be password text. Now you don't always have to name them but I like to name them just in case I might need to use them for future reference. Now the next thing I want to do is add a button to my for more information, go to mockflock.com and search for Episode 2, or choose the link in the description.